Hey everyone, I haven't had much of a chance to get out and shoot any new footage for vlog material lately. It seems like every time I schedule a flight, the weather goes IFR, the winds pick up, or the planes have maintenance scheduled. Instead, I went back and took a look at some footage I shot last year just after I got my private pilot's license. So this is a flight with my sister and her husband back from Healdsburg, California to Livermore, California, with a Bay Tour en route. My sister is not the biggest fan of commercial aviation. She doesn't really like flying uh, commercially, and she thought she was going to have an absolutely miserable time flying in a small plane, but she was humoring me on this flight. As you'll see, though, she actually had a lot of fun on this flight. Hope you enjoy the video, and if you do, give me a thumbs up. Subscribe if you like my vlogs and simulator tutorials. And go take a look at my Patreon if you'd like to support more videos like these. Happy flying. You on, you're on. Mixture lean is required, oil pressure looks good, temperature's coming up, 122.8, and it says if I click three times I should get weather. Healdsburg Municipal Airport, automated advisory, wind 130 at 10, altimeter 2, 9, 2, for runway, listen for traffic. Okay. Alright, altimeter set. We got the weather advisory. It went right, right down the runway at us at 10 knots. Get my horns on. Fuels both work good. Carves out. We'll turn nav and landing light on. Pressures look good. Everything looks good. Flaps up. You can keep the window open until we actually take off if you want. Traffic, White Cessna 298 Golf Bravo is uh, taking runway 13 at Healdsburg. Final looks clear, short final looks clear. We will take our runway here, 13. That's fine, that's good. Airspeed is alive. Air water up there, okay? Taking off a second time isn't as scary. Yeah, there's not any gusts here. It's just a uh, constant wind. There you go. Makes it a lot easier. Uh, how pretty that is. Oh, yeah. Hi, Heel, sir. Thanks for lunch. Mm-hmm. Was well, a good lunch. Number 8, Golf Bravo, traffic off the left wing, about 3 miles southbound, type unknown, 2,300 indicated. Roger, looking for traffic, 8, Golf Bravo, I think I have him in sight, but I'm not sure if that's a bird or not, uh, 8, Golf Bravo. Number 8, Golf Bravo, and as I said, it, he appeared to turn to westbound, he's heading right for you now, 2,400, looks like he's going to pass right behind you. Affirmative, I got him in sight, 8, Golf Bravo. There's a guy right behind us over on the... I see him. So the cool thing is if you're not holding onto the yoke, you can actually steer the plane with the rudder. By putting a little bit of left rudder, the plane will start to bank to the left. By putting a little bit of right rudder, the plane will oh, wow. start to bank to the right. Pretty cool. Yeah, it's pretty, it's pretty neat. I see San Francisco. Uh-huh. You got those clouds coming right in through that little gully.
Dark Hill Approach, Baron 858 Papa, descending to 1,500. Baron 858 Papa, roger that. You got traffic uh, yeah. just over okay. Treasure Island, 1,600 northeast bound to the sky lane. That you? Five, eight, Papa, I'm looking. No, nope, Papa, over additional there. traffic is going to be through 1 o'clock on the 4 miles maneuver in that Skyhawk at 1,100. That's me. Five, eight, Papa, I'm looking. Yeah, 1600 going northeast bound. It's going to be that way going that way. Good afternoon, radar contact. I'm in 4000. We're about 5 8 Papa traffic, 12 o'clock in. Two miles maneuvering Skyhawk 1000. That's me. 5 8 Papa has traffic. Transmission was blocked for 566 Victor Romeo. We're getting a little bit of wind coming through the bay. Restriction off of the open departure there for DME uh, at or below 2,000, sir. All right, let's turn to the uh, east. Uh, bye. We'll get out of the uh, temporary flight restriction area. Get some bumps going. You can barely see the Golden Gate underneath that fog. No. We'll have to come back for that. Navy 936 Heavy, turn right for Super Torca, maintain flight level 190. Flight level 190 and circle, uh, uh, right turn forward. Alcatraz, come back, go by Treasure Island, and then uh, fly over Mom's house. Go Cal departure, reach Med 50, 1000, climb at 3000. Reach Med 50, North Cal Approach, uh, Roger. Radar contact. Probably maintain 7,000. Yeah, we're not going to get to see the Golden Gate today. Oh, well. Got Alcatraz down there. I don't see Sean Connery. Nope. 4298 Golf Bravo, just be advised the TFR is going active in uh, four minutes, sir. Roger that. We are uh, done with the uh, bridge part of the Bay Tour. We're going to be uh, circling Al Alcatraz and then flying parallel to the Bay Bridge and then uh, heading towards Livermore over Walnut Creek. Uh, 8 Golf Bravo. 8 Golf Bravo. Thank you for that. Yes, sir. NorCal, sir, 734, Charlie Delta, level 8,500. Any whale? Whale? You can probably see a whale. It's there. 734, Charlie Delta, approach, uh, roger. And... Is that a whale? That's the first time I've seen a whale. Four, 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 four. We're 5-8 uh, Papa, roger, remain outside of the Bravo. Yeah, eight, I think five. it's a rock. Ooh. Oh well. Look at all those birds. Yeah. Holy sh... Alright, let's go see how much uh, traffic there is over at the... Uh, main radar contact. Uh, Bay Toll Plaza. All the people going to the Giants game. Hi, 2031, our counterpart, good afternoon, radar contact. So that's the Alameda test uh, uh, 57, field over there, contact. that's where the Mythbusters did all of their high speed, uh, two, four, three, two, like six, the, six, the truck stuff. Okay. Uh, it used to be an airfield, uh, got this de decommissioned a long time ago. And then just past that on the other little peninsula is Oakland Airport. When I just do a bait tour and I bring people here, I usually fly over uh, Walnut Creek, the Oakland Coliseum. They route you over Oakland Airport, so you're flying right over Oakland Airport, uh, and then down to like San Carlos and, and uh, Palo Alto, and then up through San Francisco. Gotcha. Just kind of depends on the day whether they, whether they'll let you do that or not. Toll Plaza looks like it's fucked. Oh wow. So we should have the Lafayette Reservoir coming up on the uh, right-hand side of the plane here. Flying over uh, 24 below us. I see it.
Do follow 24. Let's see if we can get a picture of my parents' house. Yeah, for sure. Do you see your mom and Gracie walking around? Yep. No, because you missed Big Grace. What, what about uh, the old dog? Huh? Otis? Yeah. Oh, Otis is long gone. Uh, poor Otis. I figured Otis was going to outlive us all. <laughs> I thought so, too. Who wouldn't make it around the reds? Feel free to call your parents and, or text them and say, hey, go look outside. We're about to fly over. We're going to have to do that with Mom when we head back. She wanted us to fly over. We're right over 24. Air track 140, traffic now uh, past the, uh, the miles change. of the north here, 2800 yeah. northwest. So. They're going to be right where that overpass is. Okay. Yeah, we're Gulf Bravo, traffic 11, 10 to 11 o'clock and two miles south on 2500 indicated, unverified type unknown. Roger, looking for traffic, uh, 298 Golf Bravo. Uh, traffic in sight, 8 Golf Bravo. Uh, heading west, shouldn't be a factor. 298 Golf Bravo, right here. They got a plane right there coming. I see him. Is that right behind you? Yeah. yeah. Right on that street. There's the businesses, keep going down, and then there's that side street. And there they are. There's their mailbox. Got it. Yep. Did you text the number? No. I did. Yeah, there's Monta Vista. So that's Round Hill below us. What's that golf course? Diablo? Maybe, yeah, the Diablo Country Club. Probably Diablo. So Mom and Tony are going to be over this way. I'm assuming that's Diablo Road going through over there. And that must be Camino Tassajara on that side. Oh, this is Diablo Alcero's right below us. Yeah, I'm about to hit the other part of Diablo that goes through the like windy part. Yeah, yeah. And then that must be Camino Tassajara going through those houses. Gotta be in one of those. I think they're in this one right here. That is Park United 1815, 3.5 climbing. On the other side of the street. Yeah. 1815, North Carolina Park, North Carolina Park, Center, descend, maintain 1 2000. 1 2000, says that 374. Southwest 4897, climb, maintain 4000. Climb to 4000, Southwest 4897. At 1850, 1815, traffic to 1 o'clock, 4 miles southbound, 5,000 members. See the two blue, uh, gazebos? 1815, Roger, maintain visual separation. Right. Oh, yeah, 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 y
Cessna 2 Niagara, Golf Bravo, Livermore Tower, make right traffic, runway 25 right, clear to land, one 24010. Clear to land, uh, runway 25 right, uh, 8 Golf Bravo. I've got the airport in sight. Prepare to fire the primary weapon. <laughs> doesn't look that bad, actually. What doesn't? Traffic. No, not right now. We were open. Looked like shit earlier. Yeah. There's the Hacienda Theaters. You should be able to see the fairgrounds at some point and uh, the mini golf place. We might fly over it on the way in. Livermore Tower, 298 Golf Bravo is going to make a uh, long rollout on the landing. Uh, we have one break that looks a little bit worn. Uh, we're going to try and save on that. Livermore 298 Golf Bravo, Roger. Take all the time or take all the uh, space that you need. Roger. Uh, 8 Golf Bravo, uh, confirming we're clear to land. 25 right at Livermore. Number 8 Golf Bravo, affirmative. Runway 25 right. Clear to land. Number 1. Number 1, 25 right. 8 Golf Bravo. All right. Always land coming this way. Usually, yeah. I've never, I haven't come in the other way, but way, but you could. Just depends on the winds. So you basically wait until the airport's like 45 degrees behind you, and then you make your turn. The pools look so nice. I know. Cut me off. Hey, you got a parachute? Forgot to pack one. Oh man. Finals clear, short finals clear, in we go. <clears throat> so those two lights on the left, you see the two and then the two? Yeah. They basically are set up for a particular angle of approach. When you're at the right angle, the top one will turn red, the bottom one will stay white. So you see the top one's getting kind of pink. Yep. So we're at a good angle. Um, basically, if the bottom one gets red as well, you're too low, but the closer you get, it's going to eventually get red anyway. Uh, it's more for like a far out kind of placement. So we're looking good. Top one's red, bottom one's white, and we're lined up with the runway. And that left one's going to start to turn pink right about now-ish. Down, down, down. Power off. Hold it off as long as I can. And nice soft landing. Thank you. Thank you very much. Flaps up. Start to put the brakes on. Use a little bit of aerodynamic braking. Golf Bravo is going to turn right at Golf. That's a Golf Bravo, Roger. Taxi to parking or fuel via Julie at this frequency. Have a good night. You too. Have a good night. Uh, fuel via this. Uh, <laughs> fuel via Juliet. I'll stay on this frequency. Hey, Golf Bravo. <laughs> 